Yesterday I did a 21 minute video on the topic of becoming a subject matter expert using three tools, InnoReader, Buffer and or Hootsuite, and a Google Plus page. And a very smart man challenged me to take that 21 minutes and turn it into a three to five minute video. So here's the Reader's Digest version. I'm using the example in this story of the trending topic, Making a Murderer, and how I use InnoReader to collect information. InnoReader allows me to track the sites, the searches, the sources, and the someday maybe information related to the topic. So what I do is I type in Making a Murderer, and as you can see, InnoReader will allow me to track my articles about it, public articles about it, articles in the current section, RSS feeds, bundles, users, Twitter feeds, Google Plus feed, and Google News. In short, it allows me to bring together information from all over the entire internet, whether it's in social media or Google search on a website or whatever. Again, the sites, searches, sources, and someday maybe information. I can or organize that content all into folders, which I can uh, quickly flip through and see if there are any good articles that I would like to curate for my page. Now, from a curation standpoint, I'm using a tool called Buffer. And one of the things that Buffer allows me to do is to curate directly to a Google Plus page. And it also allows me, <clears throat> excuse me, to schedule things so that I can um, post a couple of times throughout the day. I can fill a queue and post a couple of times throughout the day so that I'm not overwhelming people on the page with content. And one of the things that I really love about Buffer in particular is not only is it great at curation, but it has something called an optimal timing tool that will deliver my content to a place where people are more likely to see it. So all I need to do is to select my page, the number of times that I want to post, and Buffer will calculate the times for me and set up a schedule that will get my content the maximum number of eyeballs. And so here's how it works. Here's an excellent article I found about uh, Anjanette Levy, Levy, excuse me, uh, Glasses Girl in the um, documentary. Now, with Buffer, I can do one of two things. I could say, for example, uh, click on the image and say, Buffer this image, and pick the Making a Murderer page, and I can add this to the queue next, now, or I can schedule it for later. So I'm going to share this now. And another thing that I can do is uh, go into um, this post, select some text, and say, buffer the selected text. And again, pick the right page, but this time I'm going to add it to the queue, and it won't post until three days later. So this is a very quick overview of how you use these tools, but if you're a content marketer, looking for excellent content to post to your Google Plus or Facebook or profile or page or Twitter account. No tool does a better job of aggregating and sharing information better than InnoReader combined with Buffer and a Google Plus page.